there are two types of links that trump almost all others. And those two types are local business directories and local citations. So in this video, I do not want to waste any time. I want to share with you a easy and fast way for you, a local business owner. Let's go out here and let's find uh, one of the leading competitors. Now, here's what I want to show you when looking for local business citations and directories. What you'll want to do here is, and, and what I'm going to do here, and again, I'm showing you this process in order to find links. There's a lot of other link types and opportunities that you can find this way. So what you'll want to do is come on into SEMrush, all right? Go into your tool. And in this case, I'm going to put in one of my competitors. They probably don't even know I exist, but I'm going to put them in here. And here's what's great. We're going to pull this list in and bear with me here just one moment. Uh, we've taken the base site that we know has a lot of information. We're going to throw it into SEMrush, or again, there are other tools to do this. I'll share with you a few, but we put this in. So we're going to come down into here. All right. Go to Backlink Analytics. All right. Once on Backlink Analytics inside of SEMrush, the very next step is click on Outbound Links or Outbound Domains. So these are sites that this particular site is linking out to. Now, when you have a site that's housing a list of, in this case, directories and citations, and they offer this as a service, this makes a absolute great opportunity for business owners like you and I, right? Because we're able to grab the list and we can either build these ourselves, add them into tools, the list goes on and on. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna click on the export button here. And as we go down this list, you can see two fine local round table. There are some sites in here that won't be pertinent as far as directory or citation, but the vast majority are citations and directories from all around the world. All right. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to click on the export button. We're going to click on Excel. Now we have the list. The next step that we're going to do is we want to go ahead and clean this up just a tad. So that way it's shareable. So here's what we'll do. We'll come on out here. We'll go into our drive. I'll grab the download for you. All right. We'll bring this up. And then what we'll do here is we will delete these. So delete columns. All right. So we'll even put authority score. So I'm going to write the authority score or better yet, a. so this is the AS score. So now that we have this list here, uh, what I'm going to do inside of here is there's 5,000 opportunities. So control F, we're going to look for anything that says SEO, this one. All right. And then you can see what I'm doing here is I'm just going to clean this list off. All right. Now there's actually 110 that contain the word SEO, because remember they do more than just outbound link to citations and directories, but this is going to be the master list. Um, so we're going to go ahead and take this. So we're going to say citations and directories. All right. And then this is a very good list. All right. This is from around the web. Some of the most authoritative. Good. Excellent. So as you can see, there is over 5,000 on this list. And the process was very simple. Find a site or a resource or a directory that has a bunch of outbound links, throw it into a tool such as SEMrush, and then we're able to have the entire list. This is a great way to find citation and directory opportunities. Now, another really great way of going about doing this, especially if you're in a hyper-local area, and I'll, I'll, I'll go ahead and share this with you really quick, is this particular process right here. All right. You saw how I just grabbed one site. You can grab others if you ever see a list, but here's a chamber of commerce list. And then if you get this, I believe 7,500 different chamber of commerces, oftentimes you can make a donation and get a list or get a link that's hyper relevant and or very potent. There's also municipalities, there's .gov. Um, if you go to the Census Bureau, you will get a massive list of all the government agencies and companies, and there's a lot of opportunities available for local business owners, partnerships, donations, submissions. If you offer something free to the community, oftentimes you'll get a gracious thank you on one of their pages. 
All right, so I just want to point this out to you. I'm going to give you one more piece of information for finding citations and directories for your local business, all right, for your off-page SEO. Let me share with you another way. There's a lot of tools out here. Um, now, I'm, I'm not promoting the tools, all right? I don't have an affiliate link. That's not why I'm here. I want to share with you a faster and easier way to find local link building opportunities. Now, we're going to move away from citations and directories, and we're just going to talk about other types of link building opportunities. Let's just say, for instance, you are okay with opportunities such as comment links, image links, all right, maybe embed links, uh, maybe PDF links, a certain type of link. Here's a fast way to gather up a massive link list in order to work through. So what you're looking for is Wappalyzer. There's a lot of tools like this, such as built with Wappalyzer. If you just put in alternative, you'll be able to find tools that will do scrapes and look for certain features within a website. I don't have an affiliate link. I'm not here to show you this tool specifically. I want to show you the features of the tool and then you can build from there. All right. Finding link opportunities at the lowest cost possible is a top priority, right? So we want to make sure we can get the best price. Value needs to exceed cost. All right. So when we come inside of here, they're a little expensive, but when you start looking here, you can see products, lead lists. All right. What's really great about a lead list is you can come inside of here and you can find certain technologies. Do they have PHP BB? Do they have a forum? Do they have certain types of image? Is it a WordPress site? You see how you can find opportunities? Let's go ahead and open this image up. Let's inspect this image. We're going to right click. We're going to reveal in the sources panel. We're going to right click, save image as. It's a gorgeous JPEG and there it is. We could go ahead and clip that if we wanted to. And my name is Chris Palmer with chrispalmer.org. I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day. I'm going to see Santa. I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.